Good evening, everybody. Tonight we're just gonna do something simple. I'm gonna take this DX2, little toy drone, and we're gonna snap on a little FEV camera, but the way this body goes, it just doesn't fit, so I'm gonna get a little creative and do a little stick drone. This is my first concept, but I realized it's probably gonna be too close, and this is not gonna fit. The props are gonna hit it, and the uh, flight controller, so I went with this, and then I realized where's the flight controller and the camera gonna go? So we're probably gonna do something like this. So let's just get to this build, take this thing apart, and then we'll go from there. So next we're going to try to put the uh, frame together. This one will not work. It is way too small. I know the props are going to hit the camera and the board. So we're going to have to also probably snip off this battery. Run a JST, what is it, 2.0 connector. And then run one of these batteries for a little bit of extra juice. This has, this is a 350 milliamp. And it's just a little heavy too. And I'm sure this is not as powerful as this. So. We'll get that on there, get this on there. But right now we're gonna go into putting the frame together. All right. So I ran into another problem here. I centered the uh, light controller and it seems like the wires from the motors won't go to the ends. And that's okay because actually I'm going to save some weight by cutting these parts off, evening it out, and stretching them as far as I can. It should give them enough space, more than they were before in the other frame. It's going to take weight off, so I'm going to get this down to weight. Hopefully it'll be really, really light. The other one was like 41.8 grams without camera, so we're going to aim for lower than that with camera and battery. So. We'll get into that and try to take this thing apart now. So here we have the stick drone. We have it done, we have it built. Um, we're gonna actually do like a part two for the FPV camera and the FPV footage. Uh, this, The rest of this one's gonna go to pretty much just getting footage of this flying around the house, you know. Uh, right now it's raining outside, so I can't really help for that. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna upgrade the battery or not or just mount the camera right on top of the battery and solder it on. So we'll see what I do on that. That'll be in part two as well, but we're going to get a little flight, little flight test, flight footage thing in the house, get it flying around, show you guys that this thing does work. And get to that nice little flight footage. So let's just fly. <laughs> so this thing actually weighs 34.4 grams versus this thing was set up with 41.8 grams. I just wanted to add that in real quick because the main concept was to get it lighter and I did get it lighter. So on that note, we'll get into this little flight. Let's do it.
Yeah, this thing flies. It's lighter. But as you can see, it's a little touchy. So I don't want to really put the FPV cam on it yet. Until part two. And then we'll take it outside. But hopefully it won't be raining. And it won't be nighttime. So thank you guys for watching. Appreciate you guys. Every single one of you. We're getting close to 750 subscribers. So I really appreciate that. So you guys have a great night. And we will get this thing set up with the FPV camera in part two. And we are out.